Dallas County Commissioners scrapping a recently approved plan that would have prioritized COVID-19 vaccines, uh, vaccines for people in certain parts of the county. They've decided to change that plan after the state threatened them to stop sending the vaccine if they didn't make the change. Our Caroline Vandergriff with an explanation, all new at 10 o'clock. People are, are just working their tails off out here. Uh, you know, 185 volunteers a day. Dallas County's mega vaccination site at Fair Park is open, but it hasn't been easy for everyone who qualifies to get the shot. So yesterday, the commissioner's court approved an order to prioritize residents in the neighborhoods considered most vulnerable to COVID. I think the majority's goal was noble to help 11 underserved um, zip codes. The effect, though, if we continue on that path and lose our vaccine is it will hurt people. In this letter sent to the health department today, the state threatened to cut the county's vaccine supply if it moved forward with the plan, saying, while we ask hub providers to ensure vaccine reaches the hardest hit areas and populations, solely vaccinating people who live in those areas is not in line with the agreement to be a hub provider. They have us down for 9,000 doses for next week. And if we, they don't hear about us having this resolved, then we will um, either definitely be cut back or I guess cancel our dose. Commissioners called an emergency meeting to address the problem and the debate got heated. Please do not be putting words in, in my mouth saying that I want to hurt people. We lack accountability. Judge, you lack accountability. You, were not, you have not yet been held accountable for what happened last week. But ultimately, the court agreed to rescind the order. All those in favor signify by saying um, aye. 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 Uh, motion, uh, Commissioner Price. I don't like having my arm twisted. Even with one commissioner abstaining from voting, Judge Clay Jenkins says the county will now continue to receive its allotment of vaccines from the state and then get them out to people as quickly as possible. We need to work at ways to increase getting vaccines into those high spread and underserved communities. But we've got to do that in a way that does not uh, discriminate against everyone who signs up because we are a state mass vaccination center. Commissioners plan to meet again soon to figure out a better way to reach underserved communities while remaining compliant with state guidelines. They also talked about making the process more transparent. Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News.